This is the inside of Mary Pat's trailer. This is how it can look if it's polished. Amazing amount of things work great on this old trailer. Door latch is good. Screen door is good. Yep, falls down just like it should. Walking in on the right side, beautiful shag carpeting. Up front is a fold down bed, probably needs to be reupholstered. Original like sconces, almost all the Cabinets open up like they should. This table folds down against the wall and has an extra leaf that will open up and uh, <clears throat> allow people to uh, use the front sofa for bed. Nice, convenient liquor cabinet. Plenty of windows up front. Looking out the door. This forward hatch needs to be replaced with Lexan to make it a skylight. Turning around into the galley portion. The refrigerator is missing. Next to it is the propane fired stove which looks to be in basic repairable condition. On the starboard side, kitchen sink area, nice window above, vintage towel, paper towel holder. There again, all the cabinets open like they should. Latches work well. The uh, top, still in good condition, probably for mica. Cooktop, it's a three burner cooktop, opens up. Uh, it was tested the other day. Burners worked. Underneath, nice cabinetry for dishes. The old furnace was underneath that needs to be probably abandoned. The uh, air conditioning unit is right in the middle of the trailer and it will be replaced. Walking into the mid sleeping area, bedroom area, there's another sofa that will make down into a bed. Nice window above it. Four Overhead cabinets, two on either side. The countertop here should be replaced. It looks like it's gotten wet. Nice window above. Cabinets, plenty of bins are below and also below the bed on the other side and sofa. There again, cabinets work well, latch well. On either side, on the starboard side, there's area for hanging clothes. All the PEX piping, vent piping will be run inside the closet. Going back into the bath area, Nice window that operates above the sink and on the starboard side is the tub.